All right, now. <laughs> so you went to Austin and uh, Dallas. Guess, so, whatever, whatever. Oh yeah, you went to Dallas. I went to yeah, Dallas. I, I saw. I saw I went your to live stream the, out the Blaze, Blaze Studios, as I said yeah. on Dalton's show. There was a lot that went into me going to Blaze Studios. And uh, I think I've said this already, but so at first I was going to do the ambush. I had a discussion. And then it was my understanding when I left from the restaurant that I would be allowed into Blaze slash Mercury Studios and that I would be allowed onto the show. I left and was about eight minutes, uh, 10 minutes away in a 25 minute trip, almost there basically, when I got a call that said they're not going to let you in. So it went from I told somebody that I was going to do the ambush. They said, wait, mm. hold on. Wait, hold on. We can, no, wait, hold on. I'll talk to X person who didn't have anything to do with the ambush, we'll get you in. They'll get you in, basically. And that person uh, had enough stroke, you know what I mean, I guess you would say, um, that, I would, that I thought it was kosher that I would be let in. And then about 10 minutes before I got there, I got a call saying I wouldn't be let in. And so, and they also, you know, just to, you know, basically said, do what you want. <laughs> yeah, it's up to you, right? You can still do your original plan or leave, whatever. Obviously, it's up to you. Now, I went ahead and did the original plan, uh, but they absolutely knew. Elijah Schaefer knew that. Uh, I don't know if he knew that I was going to do what I did, but uh, he definitely knew. And I think he was probably probably the one that stopped me from coming on the show. Now they blame the producer. Um. But that's what happened. Now, again, that's what I'm able to say here live on air. I, you know, there's a few. You can name names, do this or that. I'm not going to do that. But, um, well, let's just let's just play this. Sydney live show. The Young Pei Chang. Well, Sydney live show. The Young Pei Chang says, Hi, Adam. Hi, Ash. Uh, this has been tough with no Elijah and no Sydney live show. The withdrawal is too real. Uh, well, thanks for, for joining on to my show. Um, I, I appreciate that. Yeah, it's, um, I, I'm, I know some stuff about it. I just, I'm not allowed to talk about it. So, Sydney live show. The huh. Not allowed to talk about it now. I don't know if you noticed this, Big Tech, but uh, when they started trashing me on the show, Sidney Watson got up and walked off set uh, during that part of the show. I didn't know that. I did not know that. Yeah, she, she actually... Up, why did she get upset? She said that she... Uh, something about she had to go do adult things or something. Basically, they were being babies, being kids. And she got up and left the show when that happened. Can you play it again? Um, that this clip or that clip? Wait, is it a clip? I was just. If talking somebody, to somebody has the timestamp, miss something that caused her to go out. What caused her to walk out of the studio? Um, because they were gonna trash me, and then she. Got oh, because of that. Yeah. Yeah, they mm. they were going in on me, and so she got up and left the studio. So what's the theory? Did she have loyalty to you? She just not like that. Well, I mean, I don't like have it? to have theories. I, you know, I mean, I know what happened, but I can't. Oh. Uh, I, I don't know. I can't. I mean, I don't know. I haven't talked to her about what she did. Did it just dawn on her all of a sudden how gay Elijah is and she was disgusted and had to run out? I I, I, um, I haven't talked to her about what she did on set or anything like that. I haven't talked to her um, at all, actually. By the way, it's funny that Elijah Schaefer still follows me. I unfollowed him. <laughs> um, but... Um, no, I haven't talked to her about it. I'm just noting. I'm just noting that she got off set and got up and walked out. Mm. I'm not mm. saying anything. I'm just. I'm just noting that. Uh, I'm noting that uh, there there hasn't been any, any of their shows in two weeks, and it doesn't look like there's going to be any more, uh, possibly ever. 
I don't know if this is the time or place to say things about either of those guys, so I won't, but I'm not sad to see that show go. I know they were nice to Nick, and they had him on, which is really cool. It was good for good for Nick and good for us. So I think it was good know. to have him on. Um, it was good. But, um, you know. But I don't know if they were doing a lot of other good with that show or not. I can't tell. No, I'm looking <laughs> I'm looking at chat. Now, somebody, um, I don't know if I should repeat that on the kill stream. I, I think that was on Dalton's show that they said something about um, uh, Sydney's status or whatever. I, I'll just say, and I don't know anything. Uh, I don't have anything on that front. Uh, I don't know anything directly is what I'm saying, that she's, that, that she's not going to be there on the show anymore or whatever. Uh, I'll say based on... Uh, what I've heard, uh, I don't think they'll be doing a show together anymore. So mm. we'll see if that uh, changes. <laughs> uh, but I don't think they'll be doing a show together anymore. Uh, I didn't actually realize that it was like that and uh, haven't been paying attention to it at all, really. Um, so I didn't know they hadn't done a show in two weeks. But uh, when I saw this earlier, and then I saw this clip, uh, I guess it's Adam Kriegler here. Uh, Kriegler? Kriegler? Whatever. Uh, and saw some people in chat. So I, 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 based on that and then what I've also seen, it just doesn't look... It, it doesn't look that great uh, for the show coming back. Now, they said smash or pass Sydney. Now, she's never been on the show, so you know the rule, of course. She's up for smash or pass. I'll tell you what somebody else... <laughs> I pass. I pass on Sydney. Uh, I, I mean, I shouldn't answer because she might be, I guess, at a certain point. But um, I, I'll tell you what the guy, we went up there with like a mob, dude. Hold on. Wild speculation sent $3 Sydney Watson Cozy Channel incoming. So we went up there with a mob and this guy goes, man, you know, she didn't look that hot on camera, you know, when I saw her. But then when I went up there in person... I'm sorry. She was. She walked in. The, some of my people got there first. She got there first, right? Ricada got there before both hosts. Pokey Cell sent three dollars. I have a queue for big tech. I'm loss in hair and am balding. Should I just embrace it? I can grow a beard and niggers like you give me hope. Also, why did Savannah leave Elijah? Not Savannah, but um, what do you say? Uh, I think hair is cringe. I think everybody should just shave it all off. The fuck? Get rid of it. You don't need hair. What about your beard then? And I'm definitely not. No, beard is beard's not hair. Beard is beard. <laughs> a beard a beard's closer to fur than hair. It's different. <laughs> I mean, it's different. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> um, no, nah, no, nah, hair is for girls, dude. You got hair, you're. you're <laughs> bitch. This sounds like a bald nigga saying that. All right, now. What else? No, I'm, I'm not coping, dude. It's real. <laughs> <laughs> I I'll, honestly, I have. I'm kind of jealous of like, like you look good with this bald head. You know what I mean? If I shave my head, my head's so big, it would just look like insane. So please let me keep my hair as long as I. I can. do feel grateful that at least I don't look bad bald. Someday. I'll never take a hat some, off. If some, I was bald, guys can't pull it off. Yeah, that well. I'd never take a hat off. I'd never take it off. Even yeah. now, my hair is great. I still have. Pl all my hair, uh, but it's gray, so it's, it's thinner. You know what I mean? It's like uh, partially gray at least, uh, so it's a little thinner than it was. So it's not as uh, it doesn't get as much coverage. So I was looking at it, uh, I don't know a few months ago. I was like, oh damn, shit's not. It's hard losing the hair, dude. I used to have beautiful. I haven't hair. lost like, any. Now wait a minute. I didn't say I lost any big tech. Hold on. Wait I'm a minute. About me, dude. Okay, I just want to be clear. I didn't say. <laughs> I didn't say anything about losing any hair. I just want to be clear. I still have a luscious no, mane. Not worried about it either. Not yeah. at all worried. I just want to be clear. Uh, you are here. I think they're worried. Their fan base is because uh, I think that show's over. But mm. we'll see what happens. Uh, and again, I actually do wish the best to Sydney Watson. And if that means getting back together and doing the show, that's cool too because uh, she's actually uh, been pretty cool uh, as far as I can tell uh, and know. Uh, Elijah Schaefer sucks though. So I would, I honestly hope that the show's over because I think she would be, she's probably getting held back by this faggot. So. 
That's kind of my view on it. I, I'm not. A, I'm not. She a could come guy. around too. I mean, there's always hope, but she's a she's a little bit too boss bitch, a little bit. But maybe she'll figure it out. Maybe she'll find the right. Yeah, place. but you can channel that though. That's shit. You know what I mean? Like maybe no, put that in the know. right lane. I don't know if that's ever good. Uh, I don't know if it's ever, ever, ever. You know, good. I got a different programming eye, big tech. You know what I mean? Okay. Uh, well, you're the yeah, pro. yeah. I mean, a, a hot Australian chick. I don't know what could we do with that. I mean, uh, uh, but yeah, that's what I mean. It's great that she's hot, but maybe we could also find she could find her way and it, learn how to stay in her lane rather than. But you know what was funny? The guy, the dude who was part of the. Uh, Let's the, say the if, if we made her my co-host, maybe I could get her. If we, we just could, made her big tech property, is that what? That beast. Maybe we could get her. <laughs> If we just right sign her over belongs. to Big Tech, make her Big Tech's property, do we think we can, mm-hmm. Big Tech could get it right? I think probably. Yeah, you get it. Yeah, maybe maybe that's what she needs. Anyway, the guy goes, he's just like, she's one of the finest women I've ever seen. <laughs> the guy was talking no about she's not the, yeah, when she walked, because she walked past, she walked in first, and then they had already got there, and then she walked in, and then I got there, and then Elijah Schaefer got there. I literally started my stream and got there right when I started the stream. Like, I don't know, three or four minutes before Elijah Schaefer rolled up. Uh, and the dude just goes, she's so fucking fine. Like, I was like, okay. He was simping, I guess. He was IRL simping, big tech. Um, but uh, I didn't see her because uh, I wasn't there yet. So hmm. that's the report. Well, I think she's got uh, evil magic witch powers, and she... Um, betwixt your friend, Bewitched probably. Him. I think that ass uh, was that's, betwixt. That's always my impression of her. Is that when I watch her, I'm she's a literal witch and she's casting spells on people and <laughs> ruling that place with dark energy. <laughs> <laughs> she's got some kind of spell, I think. Yeah. yeah, she looks like a witch right out of a Disney movie. Hmm. Women are more likely to use witchcraft, too. I mean, that's I mean, they you know what I mean? Like, they're prone. I, I guess, can men even use witchcraft? There's like warlocks, uh, right? Yeah. Men can do spells and shit. Like, like, fucking, yeah. like, I mean, I don't even know what. What do they're, you know? They're about? even more powerful at it. It's called it's called Judaism. <laughs> 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 it's called Kabbalah. Holy shit! <laughs> but uh, but yeah. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Wolf. Remember to like and subscribe.